In this video, we will show you how to configure your Gmail and custom OAuth client, which is useful for connecting restricted Google services like Gmail to Make account. This is useful for your personal account, which are ending with at gmail.com or at googlemail.com. Also, for your internal use, like Google Workspace users who prefer to use a custom OAuth client. In a sense, there are five steps to connecting to Google services using a custom OAuth client. First, we need to create a Google Cloud Console project. Then we will enable APIs. Then we will configure OAuth consent screen. Then we will create client credentials. Finally, we will connect it to make with the custom credentials. Let us first create a Google Cloud Console project. First, we need to log in to Google Cloud Console. Type in Google Cloud Console in the search bar. Then click on this Google Cloud Platform. If you already have an existing project, you will be seeing this screen. Click on this top menu here in the drop down box. Then you will see this new project. Click on this new project. Let us give a name to this project. Let us call this Gmail use with make. Then click on this create button. We can click again in this drop down box and select our newly created project. This is the one that we just created. We have selected the newly created project here. Then click on this navigation menu. Then click on this API and services and click on this library. We want to enable Gmail API. Search for Gmail here. Click on this one. Then click on this enable API. You can see here the Gmail API is enabled. Now we will configure the OAuth consent. Now on the left side, click on this OAuth consent screen. Under user type, click this external. Then click on this create button. In the app name, let us type in make. In the support mail, select your Gmail account. Scroll down. In the authorized domain, click on this add domain and then add make.com and press this add domain again. This time add integromat.com. Scroll down. And then for the developer contact information, type in your Gmail account. I typed in my Gmail account here. Then click on this save and continue button. Now in the scopes page, click on this add or remove scopes. Here let us try to filter by Gmail and let us select this one. Scroll down, check modify, check compose, check read only, check metadata, check insert. Click the next page, select send, select labels. That should be sufficient for us. Click on this update button here. Then click on this save and continue button. Optionally, we can also add test users here. Click on this add users and add your Gmail account here. I added my Gmail account here. Then click on this add button. Finally, click on this save and continue button here. Now on the left side menu, click on this credentials. Click on this create credentials button. Then choose this OAuth client ID. For the application type, select web application. Here type in the name of your OAuth client. Let us call it as make. Then scroll down. In the authorized redirect URIs, click on this add URI button. Here we need to add the redirect URI for make. Let me paste the make URI here. I will also like to add for integromat.com. Click on the add URI again and paste integromat.com URI. And then click on this create button. You can see OAuth client created. You have this client ID and the client secret here. Copy these two values and store them somewhere. We will be needing them later on to use with make. I'm copying this client ID. I'm pasting it here. Then copy the client secret value. I'm pasting that one also here. Then click on this OK button here. Now let us go to make and establish the connection to Gmail. Let us add the Gmail module here. Now it is asking us to make a connection. Click on this create a connection. Give any name you want. I'm just typing in make Gmail. Then click on this show advanced settings. You can see now we are being prompted for client ID and client secret that we have already stored. Copy these two values that you already stored. Here I'm pasting my client ID. Here I pasted my client secret. Then click on this sign in with Google. Then select your Gmail account that we have configured. 
you may get a message saying that google hasn't verified this app but you can click on this continue button here it is asking you to sign into integromat.com just click on this continue button so here again it is asking you what permissions you want to grant check this read compose send and permanently delete all your email from gmail scroll down and then click on this continue button we have successfully connected our gmail to make you can now edit your scenario and add more modules to continue with your work you have successfully configured your gmail and custom oauth client so that you are able to connect to make bye until next video